here we are having another problem on series. So, here is the problem for you. So, sum is equal to 1 factorial plus 3 factorial plus 5 factorial plus 7 factorial up to n number of terms. Here in this case the value of n is equal to 4 if you do the sum up to 7 factorial. So, place number 1 that is a 1 factorial, place number 2 that is about 3 factorial, place number 3 that is our 5 factorial, place number 4 that is our 7 factorial. In this way the problem has been given. So, this is the respective output. So, here this i is ranging from 1 to 4. So, this is my 1 factorial, this is my 3 factorial, this is the 5 factorial that is 120 and this is our 7 factorial accordingly. And if you go on adding with the sum and that is the final sum going to be printed. So, here in this program we shall write only the required number of instructions and required number of statements and we should eliminate all the redundant calculations so that my program will remain optimized and can give us the answer as fast as possible. So, try to eliminate all such redundant lines in your code. So, at this moment you can pause the video and you can go on writing the code yourself otherwise the solution is always with you. So, here is the practical demonstration of the implementation of this problem in C language. Here the series is 1 factorial, 3 factorial, 5 factorial, 7 factorial and so on. So, here I have written the program partially rather incomplete. I shall have to discuss the logic to complete my program. Variables have got defined, n has been taken from the keyboard as input, sum is equal to 0, fact is equal to 1 because the first term is 1 factorial which is equal to 1. So, fact has been initialized with 1. I shall be executing one for loop for n number of times because n number of factors are to be added. So, now sum is equal to sum plus fact. So, initially sum value was 0, fact value was 1. So, 0 plus 1, 1 will be assigned to sum. I am printing the current and temporary values for i, fact and sum respectively. Now, see from the 1 factorial, how can I get 3 factorial? That means, I should multiply 2 and 3 with 1 factorial to get the 3 factorial. So, for i is equal to 1, the factors to be multiplied are 2 and 3. When the value of i will be 2, I am having, when the value of i will be 2, I am having 3 factorial in fact. How to get 5 factorial from 3 factorial? And the terms are, factors are 4 and 5, they are to be multiplied. So, 4 and 5 are to be multiplied. So, in this way, if I proceed, for i is equal to 3, the factors are 6 and 7. For i is equal to 4, the factors are 8 and 9 respectively. Okay. Now, what is the expression for factor 1? For 1, i is equal to 1, factor 1 is 2. For i is equal to 2, factor 1 is equal to 4. For i is equal to 3, factor 1 is equal to 6. So, it is nothing but 2 star i. And what about factor 2? Factor 2 is nothing but factor 1 plus factor 1 plus 1. So, 4 plus 1, 5 will be there. 8 plus 1, 9 will be there. So, my factor 2 is 2 star i plus 1. So, now let me write this codes here so that my program can execute accordingly. So, I have written fact is equal to fact star 2 star i into 2 star i plus 1. So, let me go for compile and run. This is my output screen. The program is side by side. This is my output. I am pressing 4. I am giving 4 as input. So, i is ranging from 1 to 4. Facts are ranging from 1 factorial, then 3 factorial, then 5 factorial and this is our 7 factorial and the sums are increasing accordingly and finally, the sum is getting printed as 5167. So, in this way, the series program can get implemented using C language. Thanks for watching.